Hello, Family of Light, and welcome back to my channel. This is Davida with Medium of the Light Tarot. Um, this is going to be Rando Read Messages from Spirit number four. So let's see. I guess let's just get into it. So please um, make sure that you like this video and or unlike it, whichever one either you resonated or didn't with it, because I want this to be passed around to anybody who needs to see this. Because my intention is to bring healing to all of those and expansion and growth for not only you and everyone else, but myself as well. Alrighty. So this is the Oracle of Visions. What we've got for today so far is the swans. Feels like this woman is trying to come into the love for herself. So this is about loving yourself. You know, and also maybe you're not feeling like you belong, but you do. So maybe there's an instance where you don't. And here's another one about looks and vanity. Maybe you're being really hard on yourself today. And this is breaking out of the mold, which is a good progression. You know, breaking out of kitty cat. No, you cannot go outside yet. Stop, Riley. Sorry. Kitty cat drama. And you can see how these two are jealous that this horse was able to finally break free of its own devices. Let's see now. Let me do some of these healing cards. A good friend gave, gave me these and they have been a gem to have. Inner child came out. Two came out here. Riley, love and have faith. And the third card, victim consciousness. So for these two, <laughs> knowing that you do belong, like, see how it's interesting because it's, Two women in water. And in this one, it's swans. And in this one, it's frogs. How funny is that? So it's like you're feeling out of your element. Maybe you're feeling not good enough. Going into those childhood wounds that make you feel not so beautiful, not so strong. That's so fascinating that those two came out together. Two women in water. Because <laughs> even look at the frogs, they're like look, looking at her like, lady, um, what are you doing in here? Well, that one's not. He's like trying to take advantage of the picture. He's like, cheese. Anyway. You know, and two, that's an example of not taking yourself so dang seriously. Right? We take ourselves far too seriously with all the stuff that's going on. You know? Have some faith here. So it's interesting in this picture, she's got this big old hair, but in this picture here, she's got short black hair. So it's like the two vastly different images of herself. And she's all into the mirrors. There's mirrors everywhere. You know, it's like breaking free from, the, from your own bondage with these ones here. Sorry, my mind went back to those ones. Now it's like loving you. Stop, and what I'm hearing from spirit here is stop trying to put on the front. Just be you. Just love you. And have faith that others do too. But the most important person is you. 
So stop trying to front. Yeah, because people can feel when your energy isn't really where you're trying to pretend like it is. So just give up the ghost, you know? With this breaking free from your own bindings, you're breaking free from being a victim with this victim consciousness. It's interesting with these um, rando spirit messages seem to kind of circle around here because we've had this one before. Sorry for the glare. But yeah, breaking free from your own victim consciousness, you know, involves, you know, you are good enough. You do belong. You know, you do belong wherever you're at. That is where you belong. That's where you manifested yourself to be for the moment. Right? So let's get, because they specifically asked for these cards first, even before these other ones. What do we need to hear? What do we need to surrender today? Surrender to receiving love and support. Wow. Because that's what you were talking about. You know, stop fronting. Stop worrying about trying to fit in. Have faith and love yourself. Surrender to receiving support and love. Allow the love and support of others in rather than trying to handle everything yourself. This can take the pressure off and simultaneously nurture you. It's interesting because it's kind of like a, it was a flip side of the message that I was getting. But too, when you love yourself and you have faith, then you can let others support you. But if you're thinking you're not good enough, you block it. Okay, Spirit, what other messages for today? They're saying we're going to take... Oh, we're going to take this one and another one. What other messages here? Resilience. Know that you're strong enough... So whatever you're going through here, you're strong enough to work through it. Love you. <laughs> My cat will not stop trying to get out the door. Let's get a message here. Bat spirit. A rebirth is assured. Yeah, especially when you start knowing that you belong that you have faith and you love yourself and you stop trying to front you move out of your own way out of this victim consciousness oh I'm not good enough uh. and then having the strength and the resilience this rebirth will come and I, this is hearkening to you that it is coming so you, you might as well start working on this stuff now especially with um the portals that are coming up for 1212, 1221, you know, the next ones, then it just keeps going. But, you know, it gives you the opportunity to skyrocket into the next level of development for you. So I hope that that was helpful. And I'm going to go let my cat out before he, <laughs> he loses his shit. <laughs> All right. I wish you could see him. Maybe you can. Let me see. A little turd. There he is. Oh, now he stopped. All right, you guys. Have a good one. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Riley.